Hello Guardians, I am back from the Dead One, and today I'll be showing you how to solo the Sepulcher Legend Lost Sector. You can find it on Savathun's Throne World in the Fluorescent Canal over here. Let's drop in and go check it out. So once you get over here, you can see the tall pillar right here. And if you look under this walkway, you'll find, if you see on the flag, Elder of Reflection, just start the Lost Sector. In the bottom left, you'll still see Legend Lost Sector for whatever reason. It's not showing the modifiers and everything that would typically be on that screen, but you can still see them in here. Shield of foes you'll face with arc and solar shields. Solar burn, plus 50% solar damage dealt and received. Fire pit, when defeated, acolytes spawn fire pools that cause damage over time. Champion foes, you'll face barrier and unstoppable champions. Match game, enemy shields are highly resistant to all match elemental damage. Make sure you're using Arc and Solar, either energy or power weapons in subclass to cover both shield types. Equipment locked, so we won't be able to change our gear in the Lost Sector. And limited revives. Limited fire team revives. Gain additional revives by defeating champions. Okay, for this run, I'm using Sunbreaker, Osseo Striga, Eternal Blazon, and Sub-Zero Salvo. With Infernal Whip, Rocket Launcher Scavenger, Solar and Arc Damage Resist, and Rocket Reserves. Anti-Barrier Scout Rifle, and Scout Rifle Reloader, and Rocket Launcher Ammo Finder. So hit the knight in the first area with your scout rifle, and then you can start using Osseo Striga to rip the ads apart. Come up here and throw your grenade at the the witch and hope that it hits her, but if you don't, overpower her with the rocket launcher. And watch out for those fireflies. You can use Osteo Striga to lower the anti-barrier's health. Make sure you got your scout rifle out when he goes to pop his shield. Broke, switch back to Osteostriga, make sure you get that poison tick damage going. Pull out your rocket launcher for the Lucian Hive. And make sure to take out the ghost. Okay, once the unstoppable gets close enough, you can hit it with our throwing hammer. Come on. There we go, got him. Stuck there. Of 
try to lure see if we can lure him up here a second time okay wait for the grenade and the super to go by there we go keep using the submachine gun to take on the damage and oh he finished <laughs> Sometimes that will happen. I did not think that... I didn't think that Ogre was finishable. So some, we took out one of them, and that's... That's still good, but that is not what I was trying to do. And yeah, for better for worse, we got one of them. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, sometimes it doesn't pay off to... Stand in there and take the damage. This is a really bad spot to be in. No, oh, come on. Well, the tick damage ironically took out the champion anyways. So now we just have to deal with the... With the Lucian Hive. Lucent. I'm not worried that much about pronunciation. Burn in this area is terrible. We, no. Okay, we can get hit through a wall. Uh, yep, we can definitely... Wait, what? Where's he at? Oh! I am having some really bad luck with those ghosts. Oh my gosh. Yep, and he's back up. Okay, if you're having bad luck like I am with the, uh... If you're having bad luck with taking the ghost out or dying right after, yeah, try and finish him instead of trying to just kill him outright. Maybe an easier way to go about it. See if we can pop our super, take out the see how much damage we can get on the boss. Just take him down. There we go. We got the boss down. I think an anti barrier knight. Replay the cover right here. Come on, I can't figure out where he's coming from. Okay. Now, if you do have problems with the champions, you can just run to the chest at the end and pop it. And that will still work. Uh, in closing, I will say the Spulcher Legend Lost Sector is definitely the hardest one I've ever run into so far. With Dilution Hive and stacked on so many champions around them. This is the last sec Lost Sector I would personally use to farm exotic armor if you're doing it for that reason. I would only run this for, for the Triumph personally. And I would wait for another Lost Sector to farm exotics if that's what you're out for hopefully this video has helped you and i'll see you in the next one if you enjoyed the video make sure to like share and subscribe and hit the notification bell and turn on all notifications so you don't miss any future content 
you would like to catch me live, you can catch me on Twitch at Back From The Dead 1. Have a great day, everyone, and have fun gaming.